Alright, so, what up everybody? Oh shit. I am on my way to Walmart, because today is my sister's B-Day, and I have not gotten her a gift yet, so, yeah, I think it's mounted now. Alright, oh, it's probably... Oh yeah, so... I want to talk about like my LASIK experience. Oh yes, pull the giant knife mm -hmm. out of the toilet. Oh, oh, oh those are scissors. Oh. Ah! You paying attention? So I got like eye surgery back in July, and it was actually like I was actually like really scared, but it was more spontaneous. Like it was because of like my sister. She she just like literally like barged like one night and then she was just pretty much like hey let's get let's get eye surgery together and then like I didn't really do much much research but she was the one that was doing like all the research so she uh at first like she wanted to go to this place and I think it was around like it it would cost like 5 or 5 or six so thousand dollars and that was that was pretty much like how much it would cost like to get it done and I just felt like that was outrageous but then our friend David he he found like this pretty good deal so pretty much like the deal was it was like 50% off but the thing is it was one of those uh, what do you call it I'm trying I can't remember the name Groupon it was a Groupon I was 50% off and it was like 50% off per eye and how much did we spend it was it was like around oh yeah it was supposed to be like four 1400 per eye but with the group on it reduces that to like 700 per eye so that it would cost around $1,400 to get it all done, which is a pretty good deal. Yeah, so $1,400 versus $5,000 is such a good deal. Not only that, we ended up getting like the insurance on it, which is lifetime insurance. And what that what that does is it allows you to uh, like come back whenever like even when I'm like 30 or 40. And it's like, let's say like my eyesight gets worse around that time because you know, uh, we're not perfect and things happen, you know, so I got that and that was an additional $500 per eye Which you know, it, it just sounds weird, but it makes sense because some sometimes some people just have like not good vision in like one eye So they're like, you know, it's it's not like a flat rate for like just to get the surgery But you know, it's like per eye It sounds it sounds weird, but Anyways, so my experience, I was actually scared, but not only like, I mean, I was really scared, but I think because I was, I had to do it with someone like my sister, like getting it done with another person, I think that made it like easier and I didn't feel like alone, but we ended up getting separate types of surgeries so like all right i'll be back all right so just finished walmart and didn't see what i wanted and damn that car got fucked up all right so yeah i mean all i got like my for my sister is shit's pretty good the those purple chips all right, I'm gonna go try GameStop and hopefully I find something. All right, peace. And I decided on a Funko Pop. I even bought one for myself. So like my sister likes uh, Supernatural, so got her this, which is Castiel. Oh, it's funny because the guy that helped me out was uh, was like one of my classmates in my accounting class, so that was pretty. But yeah, and the one I bought for myself, it's just Piccolo. It's pretty cute. Where is Piccolo? 
I am driving, so this is hard to do. Piccolo. Piccolo part two. Yeah, so back to like when I was talking about. Holy shit, that is a nice car. I I just saw a McLaren. Shit, what the fuck? What the hell is that doing here? Dude, there's like never cool cars here. Really nice. It was orange. But okay, so my experience, it was I was scared. And like when uh when I when I got it like done or like during like the procedure, I was I was st I still had like a lot of adrenaline like going through like my body, so I it was like the meds that they gave me to help calm me down like didn't calm me down, so like there was I'm pretty sure there was like I wouldn't say nurses but there was like three assistants like um that's helping out like the surgeon and those like those like three assistants one of them was like holding like my my head down and then there was another one like kind of like keeping like my legs down then there was another one like pretty much just holding my hand because i was scared so i held on to her hand and then on my other hand i was holding on to a teddy bear so that was that. I was I was a little boy and I'm a grown man but little boy that I be. So pretty much I don't know and also I felt it was uncomfortable. Like so they put this thing in your eye and what it does is it keeps your eye open. But it felt painful so they kept on putting like droplets in my eye so I wouldn't like feel pain from it but mechanism it like pretty much goes on my eyeball and it like suctions onto my eyeball it kind of looks like a weird a weird tripod clamp and it like 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 sucks onto my eye it was it's it's uh it's pretty it's pretty trippy like and also um when it was on my eye it didn't let me move my eye so it kind of keeps your eye in place and that was also kind of weird like you know not being able to control like where your eyes gonna move it's just kind of like sitting there oh and then so after they do that and then pretty much so I got LASIK so that means they they cut they cut through your epidermal layer. I f I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm saying it wrong or I think there's another name. Pretty much they make like a flap and then they, f uh, as they open it, then they get a laser beam and they shoot in there and then that somehow corrects your vision. Either way, um, like after they cut open and then there's a part where it's like, I gotta look at a light for a really long time. Um, I smelt, pretty. it smelled weird because like pretty much they're burning like my eyeball and I smelled that and I really wanted to gag but I didn't gag but like I don't know it just smelled really weird yeah that was like my experience like my surgery experience like that that's pretty much what what I experienced and also um but afterwards like um, pretty much everything looked hazy and it hurt to have my eyes open so like pretty much my eyes were always like squinty and I just wanted to sleep but um, when I was in the car so like we left like the facility and we're in my like my sister's car and I was in the back seat uh, they uh, they I asked my sister if I can take like a like one of her doses so I can like uh because I was feeling a lot of pain so I took like some ibuprofen and then I took like another pill of diazepam and that that pretty much fixed that but I like passed out in the car but we went to go get sushi with Brian and I don't really remember it but I don't know. I think it's because I was so drugged out. I don't really remember that part. I just remember passing out and then getting home. And then afterwards, like, um, what's up? Uh. Oh, yeah. Here's yours. Oh, my God. 
god, that's so cute! Yeah. I like yeah. this! Oh my god! What yeah. the fuck, they got this there? Yeah, I got the last one. Yo, hey, can I sit in here? Yeah. Hey, do you want to drive me to the store? Okay. okay. Oh yeah, these chips are yours too. Oh, that's This cool. is for me. Uh, what's that one? Oh, it's Piccolo. They gave me a big bag. What the fuck? Dude, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, well, I was just talking about like when I got LASIK. Oh, are you still doing your video? Yeah. Your yeah. LASIK experience for Yeah, me? yeah. Well, I I didn't, I was the only one that had it bad. You didn't really have it that bad. You said it was like a walk in the park, but for me, I was like feeling like pain. Yeah, because I was like super high, but I think you didn't get enough drug. Oh my god, this is so cute. They love but yeah, that's that, and oh, peace out.